Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for stopping by. I really do appreciate it so very much. If this is your first time, welcome. Um, if you would, like, if you like what you see here, if you would hit the subscribe button, it would mean so much to me. If you are one of my subscribers, welcome back. I am so glad to see you again. Um, today's video is going to be a little different. Um, I thought I would do kind of life updates because um, I've been really sporadic the past couple weeks here on YouTube and I thought I would tell you guys why. So, um, first off, as you probably can tell from my title and also how I've talked in past videos, I am a teacher. I teach at a university and um, I've been an adjunct for the past three years and before that I was a TA for two years, which meant that I taught classes just like any other teacher at a university. Um, but I, over the summer, got the opportunity to become a lecturer, which is really exciting because that is a full-time benefited position and I have never had benefits, so that part is really stressful. I'm trying to go through all the paperwork and figure out um, decisions on things of what insurance I want to get, life insurance, retirement, all of that crazy stuff. I feel like I should know all of this, but I don't because I've never had, been in the position to have it. So um, I will be teaching more. So I'm tr going to try to still get up at least two a week. Um, I've been trying to do three. Like I had a set schedule over the summer pretty much of Sunday, Tuesday, Thursday. I don't know if that's going to work or not. Obviously, I'm filming on a Sunday and I have not gotten up a video since last Tuesday. Um, so trying to get situated teaching full time is going to be difficult so please bear with me um that will also um kind of affect the giveaway that i have planned um i was hoping to get it up september 1st but i don't see that happening at this point because i need to get everything together and organized and filmed and i don't see me doing that um before the first so it will be coming it is coming in september so just keep that in mind that it is coming it's just going to be a little delayed because when I originally said I wanted to do September 1st, I was only going to have a part-time job. Um, so I was, I've had a lot of things explode. Um, with that, I had been tutoring here on campus with a wonderful group and I had to stop doing my tutoring. So in some ways it's nice that I don't have like four jobs now. I am down to just two. Um, because I was also teaching dance at um, both at a local grade school here in town and then I was also teaching at a studio. I'm not going to be teaching at the school. I might do that in the spring depending on um, how the fall goes. So I went from four jobs down to two. I'm still teaching at the dance studio and I sent them my schedule once it was changed and Knowing that I was going to be full-time, I was thinking they were only going to give me like a couple classes, which is what I've usually been teaching, like one to three classes a week since I graduated or since I went to grad school. But I am teaching six classes now, so full-time job teaching four courses um, at a university. I, I teach first-year writing, so they're all freshman um, level students. So I'll be teaching four courses a week. And then I also, which are multiple days a week, and then I'm teaching six dance classes. So I'm going to be really busy. I'm pretty stressed about it, um, but I'm also really excited to finally kind of be have a better paying job and not be paid semester to semester and have like a 19 week contract or 16 week contract and then have nothing. This summer has been really difficult because I didn't have a paycheck at all. The job I had been doing um, for the past few summers and Christmas breaks, fell through so I was unemployed all summer and I cannot wait till my paycheck which is next week the end of this week which is really exciting um so that happened you will also notice that I am back in my office um so during the summer I usually go visit my dad so I'm an only child my parents are together but it's kind of complicated my dad works in another state he and then my mom goes back and forth so um i go in the summers because i can and i've been working there that's where my um, job has been so 
Um, I travel and that's um, his place when you see me with the couch and stuff. So I am now back in my office. I will be filming here because my place is just so tiny and I have so much stuff um, that, and I'm never home during the day so I can use daylight. Um, so that is happening as well. I am back, I traveled last week, traveled back to home. And so just trying to prepare for classes and everything, it's just been crazy. Uh, I'm going to film a whole bunch of videos today. I have all my unboxings for August and then I have one that came while I was gone that was a June glossy box. I got two of them. So I will do, I'll film, I'll add that onto my uh, August glossy box. So I'm doing those. I'm also doing a haul. Um, I've been trying not to buy things. I've been really poor, but all of this is, a couple of things I got that I just either got in the mail when I got home or I didn't think to include them in an earlier haul. And then things that my mom has kind of like taken pity on me in the past week and um, trying to make me feel better. So that's the other really big thing. So I've been dating somebody for two years now in August. We started dating two years ago. He was a colleague. We worked together for the first year and then he got into a PhD pro program in another state and we've been doing long distance for a year. And then last week, out of the blue, he's like, I'm moving back to England. Uh, I don't think we should drag things out. So that has been really hard and um, I keep crying. And for an entire week, I was just, I didn't do anything. Um, barely ate anything because I just had no appetite. I had no desire to do anything. Um, my mom would be like, let's go shopping, like, trying to cheer me up. And I was just like, okay. And I'd wander through and she wanted me to get stuff. And I just, I didn't want anything. And it was really hard. And I still don't know what's going on because he, we talked um, I actually drove down to where he is and I was like, hey, I'm passing by on my way home. This is the only chance we're going to have to talk. Um, so we kind of talked and I don't know what's going on with that. He regretted sending the text, but we still, we haven't really talked since talking. We're supposed to Skype sometimes um, today. Um, so I don't know, like he still wants to talk. He still wants to be communicating but I don't know if he's moving or what and it's really hard because we had been talking about getting married that's why he took the job there in the first place because um, it would make it easier to get a position afterwards so we'll see I um, am just the past two weeks have really sucked and that's part of the reason why I haven't been on YouTube so that's why I wanted to kind of do this is kind of let people know what's going on. If I'm sporadic, it's not because I don't care about YouTube. Um, although that week that I was, I didn't even like really want to watch videos. I watched a couple and I was just like, it's not making me happy. Watching even some of my favorite TV shows, like I love Girl Meets World because I was a huge Boy Meets World fan and that wouldn't even cheer me up. It, like I didn't want coffee which I usually love coffee so much um, and coke if you my friends know that I, I joke that I'm a coke addict I just have it's the legal type because I always have a coke like that is my thing I love the carbonation and coke didn't even taste good like I felt broken and I'm feeling a little better but I still feel pretty vulnerable and I don't know what's going to happen with anything right now so I'm trying to soldier on trying to get um, back into the swing of school back into the swing of YouTube so bear with me if it's sporadic or you don't see me posting it's not because I don't care and that I'm not um, that I don't want to talk to you guys it's just that my life just kind of exploded everywhere so 
thank you guys so much for watching. Um, if you have questions, let me know. And I was thinking about maybe doing a Q&A later on. So if that's something you would like me to do, let me know down in the comments. I hope you guys are having a wonderful summer. I know it's ending if school starts tomorrow. Um, yeah, so hope you're doing well. Let me know how you guys are doing. I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye.